What's going on guys? What's going on Terror Squad? It's your boy Terabyte Reacts here and we are back with another Attack on Titan reaction. Today I'm gonna go for two episodes again. Hopefully I will have enough time at the end to record one last reaction for the night which is Evangelion. So we are here. And two last episodes, really, really, really good episodes. I'm digging the opening so far. I talked about the animation, the um, the voice acting, um, and also the sound design. Very, very good. And that already has me interested in this anime. Seems like it's going to be one of those animes. You know what I'm saying? Um, action-packed, as you can see. Action-packed. Um, from the opening scene alone, I know we, we've yet to see that and I can understand why they chose not. It's a build up to that point. So that's very good. I love when when anything you write in a story. I love a build up. I love a build up to get me there. You know what I mean? So I'm definitely, definitely digging this anime. Um, so what we've learned so far as you guys have explained to me in the comment section, which I really, really do appreciate that you guys explained to me what happened at the wall there with the, um, the Titan that is over 50 meters tall. Um, a Titan that's over 50 meters tall. He was the one that showed up first and they broke. That wasn't the one that broke through um, Wall Maria, right? It was actually the other Titan, the one that, as somebody described him as the Brock Lesnar-esque <laughs> um, one that ran, that I was saying seems like have a, seemed like a bit more intelligent than the other regular ones that are, you know, all w walking around naked and junk. So this one seemed the one that was tanking the, the cannonballs and stuff. That's the one that broke through the actual wall, Maria. So thanks for clearing that up for me. Because I was wondering, did they break through two walls? But... To two of the walls right which is wall maria and the next one but this was actually just wall maria um as i said it was kind of pathetic their preparation is very pathetic like they never expected this to happen um but even if you're not expected you got to be prepared right so i didn't like that so we got aaron we got mikasa and we got armin hopefully i got that right so we got those three um they join the um the um the survey corps right and now they're about to start training um Aaron lost his mom very tragic moment for the I want to call him the main protagonist they haven't really confirmed if he's the main protagonist yet but it seems like these three are going to be the three O that is con concentrated mostly in the anime going forward so i'm looking forward to that okay so we got them three experiencing that the um tragedy um you know and they had to run out of town they had to they had to get out right so i want to know um and I'm, I'm i'm just saying this some of this stuff out loud so you don't have to answer if it's a spoiler thing do not answer me okay um I'm just theorizing right now has something to do with I remember in the beginning of the episode at the beginning the first thing before they even showed no when this when Aaron woke up from the bad dream what he was dreaming about I've watched over because when I'm editing um, when I, when I'm editing out after I finish making the video and stuff, I usually go back and watch my reactions. Um, not all the time, but sometimes, but this one, I wanted to see, um, the beginning of the episode again, right? Cause I remember him having this dream. Did he, did, does he have premonitions? Because he, wasn't he dreaming of the very Titan that killed his mom? Like, or maybe they just, I, I thought he was having a bad dream. That's why he woke up crying, right? So does he have premonitions? What does this key that his father left with him means? You know what I mean? Like, what does that mean? What does this key represent 
um what is in this um this, this um I, I think it said that uh, go to the basement or something like that I, i'm not sure i'm not sure what what the it was like a dream state that he was in um that it, it i don't remember but the, he did hold up the key and i was like this key looks like it's going to be important as they wouldn't have zoomed in on it you know what i'm saying it's just small things about you know cinematography that i understand about showing things without saying things right um so let's jump into these two new episodes man i'm dying to see what they do so let's get it man let's get it on let's jump into it see you guys for the review make sure you go ahead and click that um thank you guys so much if you guys don't understand why i have a background right now i did not research it i did not research anything i asked the guys in my discord channel um to send me um a wallpaper that i can use that was safe that had no spoilers they know that i've seen some of it already and i'm guessing that's aaron standing there and that's the the titan that we saw the 50 over 50 meters so there's no spoiler here i've seen that already so if you guys are wondering if i went in search and got spoiled i did not get spoiled about anything the discord channel really came through for me sent me some images and i got to choose one of them okay so let's jump into this episode make sure you go ahead and click that link you got two choices you can watch it on the google drive or you can go to bit shoot um because i've already explained to you guys on the google drive there might be a view limit so if you can't watch it there if you watching it too late too many people has watched it already and you want to go and watch it on on the bit shoot it's a little bit less of a quality but it's still free okay so thank you guys for watching as always see you guys for the review what's going on guys we are back for the review and i have to say man that episode was really it was emotional it was funny um funny emotional at the same time I, at one point i was like i should look like he gonna make it it don't look like he gonna get it but he had faulty equipment so that explains it all um got introduced to two new characters Bert Holt, I don't remember the other one's name, um, I know one of them named, what is it, Steiner, St Steiner, <laughs> I'm trying to remember their names, the two that brought him up on the hill, um, but I'm glad that he got over, um, he was even staying upright with the faulty equipment, that goes to show you that he had a natural ability to do it from the get-go, it was just that the equipment was faulty so he couldn't really show that he could do it so i'm glad that it went well for him mikasa um realizing how Aaron really you know how he feels um about the situation um so that was really cool to see as i said man animation sound design animation sound design and just the the freaking overall feel of this story is just going to be great. Okay? Um the voice actors super super job so far. Like I'm I feel the emotion behind it and the 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 feel how people feel about the Titans. You know what I'm saying? Like they went deep into that about some people are fascinated by the fact that you know they got attacked by the Titans. So they were interested in like you know kids who doesn't know they didn't they don't know the fear of it so they're like interesting to know because somebody else went through it they're like oh my god that's so cool you survived that but at the same time they don't know how close they came to being dead you know and as always you know <laughs> Aaron want to catch some bodies as always you know from the like the first episode he's been standing up to people so it's no surprise here when you stand up to somebody in this episode, right? So, as again, man, not a long review here. It was just one episode. Man, that potato girl. <laughs> Hilarious scene when she was just in the midst of, of the 
of the man screaming at everybody, she just pulls out a potato and start starts eating. It's like, I don't give two shits. I'm hungry. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, they made her ran, run all day. Pretty much, you was already running for five hours at the end of the training day. So, I mean, and she ran until she practically passed out. Um, so that was pretty cool to see. Um, so thank you guys for watching, man. As I said, not a long review here. This was a great one. Um, so thank you guys for tuning in and watching this with me. I promise I might give you guys a couple episodes over the weekend. Um, I'm not sure yet, but I'll definitely try to get something. Um, the two, two of them, um, definitely I can't do Evangelion tonight again so i'm gonna have to try to put that out either friday or over the weekend i'm gonna try to sneak in a couple episodes because i'm a lot i'm a i'm less busy on the weekends so maybe in the midst of doing rome and um and vikings i can slip in an episode there um or so so you know I, no promises but it's a possibility, right? So thank you guys for watching once again. As always, it's your boy Terabyte Reacts. Remember to like and comment on this video. And as always, man, it's your boy Terabyte Reacts. Peace.